Hey everybody, it's Jeremy and Jay, and we are back with more Tales of Symphonia. This is episode three, I believe, and let's get out of this fucking village. If for no other, Dwifting Swoodsman. <laughs> Dwifting Swoodsman. We finally got it. If for no other reason than we can get away from that overly loud crackling fire. <clears throat> All right, so. Drifting Swordsman gets us HP and defense, but we lose strength and uh, accuracy. I think I would actually prefer the strength and accuracy. Is that milk? Jay over there with the milk? Of course it's milk. Yeah, so, so I mean, the last time we, we talked about milk, I showed you the two gallons I had in my fridge. Those are gone. And now this half gallon is as well. Yes. Watch this. Oh! Sword hey! Nice! Of course it's milk. I actually really like Sword Rain. This is a better Sonic Thrust. No, absolutely not. No, no, no. No, 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 no. That doesn't work that way. Sure does. Nope. 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 Let's go all out. <clears throat> well, that didn't work out for me. Did all your fireballs just whoosh around? <laughs> you should use you should use wind on the wind guys. I bet that'll work better. Uh, oh shit! All right, wind on the wind guys. Here we go. Oh no. Uh, that, oh, no. he just said it. Found your weakness. No, no, I have nowhere to run. <laughs> Still trying to figure out this whole direction thing with the weird camera. Yeah. You've got the uh, hard part of the game. I will admit. That's fine. I mean, that was the same thing in Tales of Eternia where I had to try to stay in camera. Huh? Sorry, I wanted to make sure I was actually hitting the right enemy with that. Preparing them sandwiches. Oop, mm -hmm. Another one. I beat that dude's ass with ball and cup game. Noise. What is that? Ah. Dear Lloyd, read the Traveler's Guide. I did not. It has the seven most well-known dwarven vows as well as knowledge necessary for your journey written in it. Use of this information to be sure to protect Colette. Fourteen years has passed since I found you and Ray started raising you. Oh, man. A, a, dwarf, a dwarfing swoodsman. A swoodsman. Yes. To set an X skill, first select X skills from the menu screen. Pick the character. Each character has four X skill slots. Select a slot to set an X gem and press, I forgot about this, and press A to display the skills that will be usable. Okay. Press A again to set the slot. Okay. 
X skills do not take effect until you choose and confirm the X skill you want to use. Skills granted by X gems can be changed. Okie dokie. Yes. Two types of X skills. You got strike and technical, depending on which types of which type you have equipped, the moves of the characters learn as they grow will change. You raise your characters as S type or T type is up to you. Also, once you have set an X gem at a spot, it cannot be removed, but you can set a new X gem into the same slot in place of it. Override them. Uh, please be aware that when setting a new X gem, the old one is lost. Of course. Compound X skills. Equipping multiple X skills may result in compound X skills. Very powerful, have special features. Okay, cool. Okay. Next skill. Lloyd has strong. Tough. Uh, Taunt. Tough. Taunt. Taunt. Or sharp eyed. Interesting. Let me just stick with strong, honestly. And magical, of course. I want taunt. You want taunt? I don't want taunt. Oh, but Jay. B do B do B do. That's a good. <laughs> that's a good menu sound. B do B do B do B do B do. That's good. He is real good. I think we're done here. Yeah. Let's -a go. Fight this boy. All right, let's go. No way. Get him. Fireball. Uh. No way. Get him. Wind blade. No way. Get him. Wind blade. No way! Get him! Fireball! Oh. Facing is important. No. Yeah, don't let people shoot you in the back. Yeah, apparently it's real bad. You picked the wrong guy to mess with. Nice. House of Salvation. Mm hmm. What's going on here? Long range mode. Okay, seek out guideposts. Yes! When moving around across the field map in long range mode, the camera pulls back further than normal, allowing you to see a wider area while moving. In addition, during long range mode, the enemy indicators will not move when the player is not moving. However, you will not be able to notice dropped items on the field during long range mode. Dropped items? Interesting. Switch between the different modes depending on whether you want to focus on movement or exploration. You can use or cancel long range mode by pressing it. Yes. You cannot use long range mode until you find the guidepost monuments located somewhere on the field. Please note that the long range mode will not be available if you enter an area where you have not found the guidepost monument. Okay. Gotcha. Ah, oh, it's a dog. We're gonna have to the do the, way. we're gonna have to do the Colette, uh, dog lover title. Oh no. Oh, and the uh, the Zelos Gigolo title. Wait, he has a Gigolo title? Yeah. Colette has dogs all over the worlds that she has to talk and, to, and, and, and he has Zelos women. Has yep, customers. <laughs> well, I don't know that they're actually customers. But he just, like, flirts with women. 
That's not. That's not. I'm Jay aware, said. Jay. Gosh. All right. On to the next thing. What is this place? House of Salvation. What is, what is this? It's the House of Salvation. You're a fucking house. I mean... Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. You, you, you are more than welcome to talk about it. Absolutely, you can talk about it. I, I leave the spoilers tag up all the time, uh, but normally that's only... That's only for a game that I haven't played before. Yeah. I guess we'd save. We haven't saved in a while. Yeah, it's been a bit. Yeah, one, th one problem minutes. with not using emulator, we don't get save states, we don't get turbo, yeah. none of that. Very true. We're in it, we're in it for real. Hey, well... Oh, right, I don't have long range mode right now. Maybe there's an option that can change how the battle camera works. Nope, don't, don't face that way, please. Oof. Yes, got one. Ugh. Uh, it was a snake. Working on it, okay? Grinding for pellets for the figurine collection. Remember, you yeah. filled up the monster book on your GameCube copy, but not your Steam copy. Nice. I definitely need a fucking heal after that. Like, ass kicked. Yeah, I don't know. Like, so I'm kind of leaving it up in the air on how exactly in depth we get with this game. Mm -hmm. Like I love the game, but we could we could sink a lot of hours into this. So mm -hmm. we're gonna play it by ear, and kind of you know, we'll see how it goes. <laughs> Maybe want to just use some. Dink. 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 You're useless. <laughs> Ow. Oh. And, you're useless and poison. But, well, I mean, so so that's just to say, like, I don't want to make any guarantees that we're going to, like, 100% anything or, or do anything like that, because... Ugh, fucking poison, man. Um, we'll actually probably just save those, because we're probably going to just heal here. Yeah, we're at a... Gate that Free. leads to the street. Wood. <laughs> But I do expect that we're, you know, we're gonna do kind of like we did with Tales of Eternia, like, um, do a lot of the things and then have a couple of, like, tail end things that we're just like, okay, we, we can't be bothered to finish this off. We played the game for, like, 80 hours. We're, we're done. You know, that type of stuff. I, I, mean, I, uh, I say I, 80 I hours. I kind of, like, pulled the trigger on the whole, we're not getting every lens in <laughs> Eternia. I'm like, I'm sorry. I'm not doing it for a title. I'm not we actually doing... weren't far off either, truth be told. Was that them sneaking? Yeah, that was them trying to like use Noish to like block line of sight, you know, hide behind.
putting up fucking wanted posters. Oh, I yeah, love I that dorky before. shit. I love it. Somebody had to draw that. Right? All right, so we got a new town to explore. Now to find Wonder Chef. Uh, there is a Wonder Chef here. Actually. Let's look at the, look at this fucking work of art. <laughs> it's so good. All right. And I think we're actually going to stay at this end. Yes. Are your early users playing this game swapping battle styles between tech and strike for everyone? Found out that Genus learned some very offensive and more elementally flexible spells for exchange uh, for losing his AoEs and not being able to use Prism Star's Genus attack. With... Ah, yeah, that's a this is that's kind of an interesting part of the game. The the being able to swap or you know being able to learn different abilities and techs based off of whether you go towards like one side of a scale one or... side or the other, basically, yeah. It's pretty it's pretty interesting. It's very unique. It, it makes it makes going through multiple playthroughs uh pretty rewarding. I think there's a I think there's a Wonder Chef upstairs. We mean a Wonder Chef. It is the Wonder Chef. Okay, yeah, yeah that's the one, the only, the man, the myth, the legend. Wonder Chef. Oh. Ah, here we go. A Wonder Chef. Gourmet. The flavor of sweet cabbage and mouth-watering meat. Cabbage rolls. I actually like cabbage rolls. I actually like cabbage. I, I, mm -hmm. I'm a fan of cabbage. Wait, she she learns revive from strike. You always go strike for for the casters, huh? Interesting. Interesting. I wouldn't have thought. Yeah, I might do some like research and look into like where I want to take which characters. Although we might actually like partition characters out, Jay. Yeah. You know, you're responsible for X character, I'm responsible for Y character of stuff. I, I think I've narrowed down my interest of characters to two. Prisea and Regal. Doifa, doifa. All right. Nope. There's new gear somewhere here. Aha. Hmm. So she she loses group heals. Gotcha. Ooh. Yeah, well, you're going to need revive because you're not healing anybody. So well, she, she still gets heals. They're more powerful, but yeah, I feel you. It's yeah, it's really interesting. Mm hmm. Bring you a beast hide and it's. Oh, oh shit. This is what the hides are for. Gotcha.
I'm somewhat interested in doing that, honestly. All right, we're definitely just gonna buy fucking upgrades. Yes, equip. Yes. Nice. Actual weapons. Hell yeah. It's a fine star. It's still ball and cup game. Win Tiger Blades. Yeah. It's a really rewarding game to get involved in. Is that another Mark the Wall hole? It's another sign of Colette, yeah. Because she's a klutz, you know? <laughs> Fucking hilarious. Sand shield. Ooh. That's what you have. Can't equip. Better for me. Better for you. I check everything. You can get a. You can finally have a, a beret of your own. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Very little, actually. That. <clears throat> actually. Good. Nice. Already Regal is uh, eager to see Regal in action. I'm I'm eager to get more characters. I do say I I I like about this game the fact that um, party members kind of come and go so frequently mm -hmm. throughout the story that it really encourages you to utilize different party members, if for no other reason than the fact that you only have so many party members at any given time. <laughs> Oh yeah. shit, is the cat island a thing in this game? Like the hidden cat island? The, the what? Uh, the, it's like our Jenny. The hidden cat island? I don't know if yeah. the hidden cat island is a thing in here, but the cats are ex exploration is a the thing. The cats. About the cats exploration team. The exploration team supports your journey. Find exploration teams like us in every city. Each city has a designated area that they're responsible for, and they are each yeah, capable maybe of investigating. Probable, okay. They're cheap. Wasting money. So you send, I think you send them out on, on exploration missions to figure things out. Map making. We'll look for the guidepost mom. Ooh, hell yeah. I would love that. Checking unvisited areas. We'll check and see if there's any place in our respective area. Okay. Hey, I want, I'm not crazy. Cat's Isle Island is here? Okay, gotcha. See if you've missed treasure chests. And... Checking monsters. If you have a monster list, we'll find out if there are any monsters in our respective... Okay. Cool. Request an expedition. Map making. Map maker, map maker, make me. Sure, a map. 600. And there he goes, I guess. Alright, interesting. Oh, I forget. You can buy Wait, things you can with. Spend I thought grade was a game plus mode With only. The thing. grade. How does this work? X gems are precious, but it's a waste to not use them. You can provide gems in exchange for grade. Higher level gem, more grade I need. Cool. Why do you have gems? That's a secret. <laughs> Go fuck yourself, cat. <laughs> yes. All right. We currently You're have 19 grade. Oisha boy. All right, 50 grade just to get a level one. Ay, my.
Oh, really right. Good. We have to do the... The... Fucking... Fortune teller here. Another dog for Colette. A place to buy bread. Oh, God. Red satay. It's fucking pricey. Can't afford that yet. Hey, fortune teller. We like to divine it for you. <laughs> That's expensive. No. Yeah, pay. We got this. We gotta eat, bitch. You didn't, we didn't pay you for the fortune. We paid you for... Here we go. Colette. Thinks very highly of you. Oh, does is, is there actually a relationship gauge in this game? I can't remember. I do not know. Has a tiny bit of faith in you. Genus has a tiny bit of faith. <laughs> Rude. Let's just, I mean, uh, we might as well check all of them. Huh. Ah, fuck. I did the wrong one. Doesn't think much of you at all. Aww. Wow. That's so harsh. Oh, no. All right. You ready for this? Ba -da -da -da, da -da 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 -da. <laughs> uh. Oh shit. I don't look like that. I don't know, it's close. One of your favorite dungeon songs, nice. Fuck yeah, let's fight. Let's go all out. Ow. Ooh. You just uppercutted the shit out of me. And then turn around and shot me with the bolt. I like how the goofy wanted poster sticks have been a thing for mm -hmm. most Tales yeah, games. Yeah, that's right. They did the same thing for uh, for Yuri. Yep, absolutely. Yeah. All right. You let your guard down. Love their like T pose, right? Walk stance. I like how Genus just like full on. I'm a child. Don't hurt me. Modes. Also, Noisha is a freaking not living nightmare. Yeah, absolutely. Get out of here, kid. Get out of here, brat. You, you're dead, son. That's what's gonna happen to you. You're done. Notice, there's so this game. This game does so much with hinting at things that the player doesn't know yet, right? Like, them them dropping, like, designs are all half-elves, right? 
Right. Um, and then them saying a fellow kinsman, but at this point in the game, you're only supposed to think that that Genus is an elf. Mm -hmm. When in fact, he's a half elf. Mm -hmm. But this game does that shit constantly, constantly dropping like little little hints to this scenario and that scenario and this character and and this organization. That game blatantly hints things very... Uh, yeah, it, it does. It's true. Sometimes it do be that way. Sometimes it do be that way. Absolutely. maybe very blind and never notice on Symphonia. I'll try to point out like the next thing that I see that happens, but like the first two hours are just every new person you meet. It's like, they're like, here's, here's this hint. Here's this hint. Here's yeah. this hint, right? Like Colette hints at the fact that she's going to die, you know, doing the oh, journey. Yeah, that's true. Um, the rebels, they hint at the fact that they're not actually designs. And then the designs later on, they hint the fa at the fact that there are designs that are it's them, right? You know, that there are rebels. Um, there's, there's just stuff like that constantly dropping all over the place. And when you know it, it all makes a lot of sense. But when you don't know it, it's just like... Oh. Yeah, I forget... Who are you talking to? He's talking to himself. Out loud? I forget Silverant is the uh the de declining world. So why'd the door open? I don't know. Actually very unsure. Voicing Smooth Bond. Nice. Recovered equipment. Cool. It's got those swords. Let's put them to good use. Good luck. Prison break! This is gonna be a piece of cake. No way! No way! See? Sonic Rain is just a better Sonic Thrust. No, it's not. Sonic Thrust hits way harder than Sonic Rain does. Yeah, it's just that it hits more often. Well, yeah, but so... It's that's not to say that it's just inherently flat out better though. Like the the Sonic the Sonic Thrust does a single big hit that's like 80 to 100 damage whereas the Thrust or the Rain does like four small hits that are like 20 a piece. Well, it's it does like three small hits that are like 20 a piece and then like one other hit that's like 30 or so. They're both fine, Jay. Gosh. I'm just saying it's like you Sonic Thrust is like, huh. And Rain is like so so, so sad. Huh. Just a better version of huh. Landis is a simple man. See many hit, do many damage. Very true. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. 
That's how I remember. That's how it works in like Blaze Blue, right? You know, well, see many hit, do many damage. damage. General. All right, so Jeremy, I had a hard time explaining this, but I like games where you can chain a bunch of shit together, right? And so, so I, I like uh, like guilty uh, or uh, Arxis fighting games because Arxis fighting games have those long drawn out combo strings that you can do. And I'm not a much as big a fan of like Soul Calibur, which while still a good fighting game, uh, does not have much of an emphasis on combos as majority of the time it's, it's reading your opponent and countering what they're doing. And there's a lot of like playing the neutral and all that shit, right? Good. But not to say it's just that like you do a special and you get like 80 hits out of it. No, no, no. That's just that's just like doing a move. I, I like the act of linking a bunch of shit together is what feels good. See, it does like a bunch of hits, but they're all baby hits. Mm -hmm. I was just warming up. Just baby hits. All right. They're not baby hits. They're like teenager hits. There we go. There we go. Easy peasy. All right. We I mean, I'm just saying, if was if someone made me an offer of being, would you like to be stabbed one time? Would you like to be stabbed five times? I'm probably going to prefer to be only stabbed once. There's so much more going on there. It's like, would you rather be stabbed really, really, really hard one time? Or would you rather be stabbed a little, you know, owie like five times? <laughs> a little owie. <coughs> All right. Just as I Easy peasy. Doifa doifa. Let's go all out. No way. Damn. Just as I expected. I need to apple up, my man. Uh, yeah, probably. Oh, a memory gem. Chain shot. No way. Sword rain. No way. Sword rain. Well, you know Jay likes those big swang weapons, so that's still not a competition for him, my guy. Like, he's always gonna go with the big swang. He loves it. Loves his big swang. I mean, at the end of the day, it's still just R1 spam. What's... I'm gonna need you to shut up. <laughs> Jay doesn't do the greatest late, late nights. 
Got that that old man fatigue. White silver. Noish. Noish. Memory gems and sealed memory circles. Yes, read an explanation. As you defeat enemies, you will sometimes receive a memory gem. Memory gems have the power to release the seal on sealed memory circles. When you release the seal, a memory circle is revived and you use it to save. Careful not to overlook memory gems and sealed memory circles. Sweet. Hmm. This game has a lot of different mechanics going on. Yeah, it does. Oh, we gotta stop these, huh? Damn it. Love. I mean, I understand it. Kinda. Let's check the uh, other rooms real quick. Nope. Oh. No, you won't. And. Nope. Oh. Right. Nuh uh. Oh, it only moved it by like a. Uh... 15%. Yeah. That's, that's a 90. Okay. That should get green. Yep. Passage to control room open. Control room? Is that where I want to go? No. Uh, Walkthrough wants me to go south first. Let's go uh, south. Do another. First. No. Oh, yeah. No, my bad. Sorry. Good point. I need to get. I thought I was trying to get blue. Uh, no worries. Get red in its proper spot. All right, here we go. Item. Magical claw. Oh boy. Fantastic. Hmm. All right. Um, Is blue just to be able to go back? I, I think so. I didn't mean to actually do that one. I think we want to do green. How the fuck are people normally controlling this, by the way? Like, all these guys got sorcery rings? I'm assuming they have key cards. <laughs> I'm just malfunctioning all these machines shooting electricity at them? Yeah. <laughs> Jesus. Just breaking shit everywhere. Hmm. <laughs> 
Rut row raggy. I'll never find you in here. Phew. That was close. I think I actually fucked up. And just who the hell are you? Yeah, I totally just fucked up. Um, soft reset. I need. I need to go back. Well, Gotta go back what? to the save. Give me your name. For what? Give you uh, I missed something. <laughs> what did you miss? Fifteen hundred gold. I'm afraid I don't see the need to <laughs> Is that not enough to, to go back for? Creature like you. I mean, it's money, but it's not like an item that's irreplaceable. What a coincidence. Because I don't see a need to introduce myself either to a moron who doesn't realize how pathetic he is. Youch! You're talking to like a 4,000 year old being there, uh. <laughs> Boy? Why, Boy. you little. Sphere, you're Lloyd, and if I am, that's sick burn. Hmm, I see the resemblance. Yeah, Lloyd has some sass. I like Lloyd because he's not, he's not a, he's a good main character. He's not super whiny, he's not super moody, he's not super asshole-ish, right? Now, tells the Symphonia 2, you get all those roll up in a nice little package. <laughs> you on wearing a very thin mustache? You're the design oh, that attacked Asalia. So you're Lloyd. Now this is amusing. Boda, I'm leaving for now. Oh, uh, I guess, yeah, I see what you're talking about. I see it. Yeah, yeah, it's a... Uh... What of the Chosen? I'll leave that to you. Understood. Lloyd. I mean, is it not a mustache? That's mine. intended to be a mustache, surely. I don't... Just you wait. I yes. don't know. That's... That's an intended mustache. You think so? You it think it's like been. like a little pencil mustache? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's not just his mouth. Lloyd, are you okay? I, I don't know. I'm not sure, but are that's what right? I want to believe. <gasps> do we get multiple party members? It looks fun. Oh no, we can't do that. You always you saw. It. I now that I've seen it, I don't know that I'll be able to unsee it. Why are all yeah, they're oh all T posing? I Perfect love their T pose walk I'll where they're like everyone get ready. <laughs> Alright, Boda fight. Ready for a real fight. Take don't overdo it. Uh do I have somebody? Oh I got Gina still. I'm just gonna spam on Boda. Don't overdo it. Alright, Boda. Yeah, it's really it's a good thing. Nope, nope, nope. Oh, never mind. Not the one I thought he was gonna do. Thought he was gonna do the big one. Alright, he's in his fucking big mood. Is he about to... I don't know. Does the... No, block does not negate all damage. It seems to be a... A, a percentage. Uh, 
All right, get ready to run. Nice, nice dodge, nice dodge, man. Cause that thing hurts. We're all out of TP, aren't we? Kick his ass. Sea bass. That, that one pretty good. Yeah, nice, nice dodge. Yeah, stalagmite. Oh, which do I, which do you like better? Uh, wait, is yeah, is the question which, which, what's the question? What's the question? Which do I prefer? Um, I think. I think for stability throughout the series, I think Stalagmite ends up being better in my opinion. But I think Grave is cooler. <laughs> yeah, the hit count. Yeah, it just have the, the <laughs> Grave Dasher <laughs> is super cool. It's just Stalagmite, more often than not, you get it earlier on in the game, and it's just a very stable device throughout all of the series, you know, so. Hey, give me that sword. Isn't this <laughs> the rain's gonna use it? Professor. Oh, Lloyd. Genus told me what happened. I apologize for the trouble he's caused you. <laughs> no, I'm the one that dragged Genus into it. I'm sorry. Save the chit chat for later. We shouldn't stay here long. You're right. I opened the escape route just now. Let's go. Now we gotta have a key crest for rain. They added nice new unison moves for the remake. Ooh. Oh, yeah? Yeah, apparently there's a lot of stuff in this. Worm Wrath. Ooh. What, bro? Sounds pretty fucking dope, honestly. Ow. All right. <laughs> Where the fuck are we? God. <laughs> Hello. There we go. Lloyd. Thank you, Papa. Thank you, Papa. Oh my god, we are booking banged up, my man. <laughs> yeah, well, it's, we just got out of, a, out of a boss fight. Goodness gracious. Now into another one. Yes. <gasps> You could. You will. You will. To great effect. <laughs> I am the better swordsman, for I have two belts.
she's just carrying around a whole bunch of shit. Yeah. <laughs> uh. You know what? I think... I, I could be wrong, but I don't think any of this stuff that she's carting around ever comes up again. And that's kind of unfortunate, because it would be cool if it did crop back up again. I could be wrong, though, of course. It, it might. But I don't remember it. Uh-oh. She, <laughs> she gonna put him in the dirt. Again. to be recarved. <laughs> nice. Noise. Kratos, aren't you impressed by by Lloyd's ability to fix a key crest like that? with dwarven technology that you wouldn't know. Oh no! There was a save point here and now it's gone. It's not. Well, this is, uh... Are you asleep? Creppy? Lloyd. Yeah, it's crappy. Huh? I'm sorry that father, grandmother, and I couldn't prevent your exile. Aww. You dork. It's not your fault, so you don't need to worry about it. See, I love Lloyd's attitude on that shit. That he's just like, whatever. You know? It, mm -hmm. it was my fault. I did the thing. And besides... I'm the reason why the village was devastated. But he's not like, so, oh, <laughs> I caused this, you know? Yeah. For Marble's sake, and for the sake of the villagers that were killed, I'm going to do my best to regenerate the world. He's got a good yeah. attitude about it. I'm sorry I woke you. He, Lloyd has a good attitude about most things throughout the game, except for a few specific things no, where okay. he has some freakout moments, Night. which are somewhat understandable considering the circumstances that he goes through. You know. Thanks. I'm gonna do my best for you too, Lloyd. Gonna die. I can't remember. Does she know that she has to give her yeah, life? Yeah, she's well aware. Okay, I, I couldn't remember if she found finds that out later. If she knew, yeah, no, she. That's that's another example, right? And earlier in on the game, yeah, right? She kind of hints at like, it right here. Right and then the when note. when you get the the note right after she's already left, you describe mm -hmm. that. This sounds like a will. Right, and oh, then her yeah, father yeah. Frank is gonna tell you. Well, actually, we we've. we've kept it hidden that she's gonna and then the designs attack and he gets cut off right yes i've been organizing the data we've collected about monsters and what are you doing up at this hour i was fixing your key crest thank you but you mustn't overexert yourself it's going to be a long journey after all i don't mind if it takes a while to fix so are you saying that it's okay for genus and me to come along on this journey well you don't really have much of a choice at this point wasn't that your you like that from the Aztec beginning? Phoenix design on the wall in the background? You know what it looks like? It look actually absolutely it looks like uh, an Aztec Phoenix. It look it reminds me of the Nazca ship from Shining Force 2. It reminds me of uh, the pattern <laughs> drawn in the sand in Illusion of Gaia. Are those? Oh, yeah. Are they the That's same the things? So here, I kind of want to look it. that up. I bet they're it, just the same ship. Might be. Here, here, here. Like you, you, same, you can like, see this. You can see rounded this. joints. <laughs> Hold on a second. This is important. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, 
Uh, maybe th that it's one's maybe similar. a little more. It's similar. Hold on. Uh, yeah. You fixed it already. Illusion of Gaia. Thank you, Lord. Sand. So this is an X sphere. Ask Genus to show you how to use it. I don't know if there's gonna be a zoom out of it though. It's kind of yeah. This one's a little more. Mine's the one I'm thinking of is a little more bird-like, and this one's a little more um, reversed. But it's really cool. Yeah, I cannot find a zoom out of the one from Illusion of Gaia. Yeah, but it's got the see the see the knees are like giant circles. Yeah, that's how they are in Illusion of Gaia too. Like those big ass circles for knees. Condor, they call it the Condor. Condor. Let's follow him. And after this cutscene, we should be donezos. What you doing with Noish over there, Kratos? Kratos? I always say Kratos, but it's he he is not Kratos. He is Kratos. Lloyd. I'm sorry to have startled you. Startled isn't the word for it. You'd best not stand behind me. I won't. Do you like animals? No, not particularly. Well, Noah seems to be quite comfortable with you. He usually doesn't like strangers. Yeah, he, he realizes and he's not happy about it, Woods. <laughs> I once had a pet long ago. Really? Lloyd. Oh, well, maybe I wouldn't realize if you didn't bring it up, Woods. Uh, you ever think about that? Lloyd, what are you staring at me like that for? Noah is his pet from long ago. Your swordmanship is unrefined. You should focus a little more on eliminating your vulnerabilities. If you care about your life. Rude? Ah, just because he's a little better than me, he has to talk like he knows everything. Well, a lot better than me. Damn! I like that Lloyd gets like how how much better Kratos is than him. It's awesome. Brother's gonna be tired tomorrow. Bro brother gonna be tired tomorrow. Hell yeah, he gonna be tired tomorrow. All right. Fortunately for Jay though, that is gonna be the end of this video. We have found a save point, um, and we've kind of we've kind of done a, a fair chunk of of getting into this game. Very yeah. cool. Um, so that's going to be it for this video. Thanks for watching, and we will see you next time. Bye, everybody.